Hello and welcome back to episode 567 of the Journey Through Games, playing almost every Super Nintendo game released in Europe and the US. Just missing out the sports games. And today we are playing Top Gear 3000. Uh, so we've got a bit of an introduction here. It starts at the, for the winner, Riches Beyond Belief. That's the only bit that you need to know about. Knowledge of the race is passed from generation to generation. Ooh. The identity of the organizer has been lost through the mists of time. Or maybe it has never been known. But even the youngest child knows on a certain date. All he has to do is look to the skies. Ooh, for a sign. The time has arrived. You are in the race. Let's turn the music down just a touch. There we go. You are in the race. Okay. Uh, championship. Right. Uh, so I enjoyed Top Gear 2. Um, difficulty. Easy music on. So I wonder if this is Top Gear 3. Uh, one player split. No, let's do one player full. <coughs> Oh, right, we have to put our name in. Uh, Jitga. Controls. So, okay. Accelerate. Break. Use weapon. Weapon up, weapon down. Okay. So, B button isn't used. Right, okay. Uh, speed miles per hour race oh, can I choose different tracks system Merak oh, paint shop okay there's a lot more options here so different colors uh, what color do we want hmm I'm thinking I like the green Let's go with that. Emerald. No, no, no. Let's go with Emerald. Oh, engine. I haven't got any credits, have I? Okay. Tires, boost, exit. Okay. Right, let's go. So Top Gear 2 was good. It was it was a hidden gem, I thought. Let's see what this is like. Oh, it instantly feels slower. Which is not great. Recharge. So is that my three laps left? So how do I fire my... How do I get any guns? I'm in first place. Recharge. Repair. Pff, hit that boost. So it feels slower. Than, uh, than Top Gear 2. Oh gosh. But how do I... Oh, my boost is like a... Ah, oh, you activate it and then it like... It just keeps going. Is that right? Does it just keep flat? Don't need the repair. We so 
So where, where are the weapons? <laughs> hmm. Ten thousand credits. Yes. Dave, Andrew, Jim. Okay, this is pretty cool. I like the sort of sci-fi aesthetic. It's a bit like an early Extreme G or Wipeout. You know, like a futuristic racing game. It's cool. I like the uh, little cutscene. Off to the next planet, I guess. System Merak name Nonet. Low oxygen. Okay. Uh, what can I have I got money to buy a new engine? Oh no, it's fifty. I've got wait, I've got a hundred thousand credits. That's the engine I've got, right? Armor. Gearbox. Four shift box, aluminium alloy, mechanical, regular. Five shift box, quasi steel, mechanical. Low ratio. Five shift. Okay. What about tires? Tire one. Jetson XL. Radial tread. Low grip. <laughs> Do you really want low grip? Let's get that. Might as well spend it all away. Can't take it with you. This is a cool looking track. We're on the moon. Go, 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 go. See, it's definitely slower on the acceleration off the line. One boost. Oh, no. I'm boosting already. Oof. Also, yeah, it's like, I think they've tried to take inspiration from F-Zero, you know, with the kind of futuristic setting, which I, I do quite like. I just, I think F-Zero did it better, and I also can't seem to find any, any weapons. You promised me some weapons, where are they? Oof. I'm in 10th place. I've been driving a blinder so far. Oh no, get out of the way. Okay, who's this? It's 8th place, 7th is just there. There for the taking, and he's took it. Oh no! Gonna have to speed boost. So why can't I boost? It's recharging. So 
So it takes a bit slower to accelerate, but it is, I think, about as fast as Top Gear 2. Or at least it feels fast, which is what you want in a racing game. You don't want it to feel slow and sluggish. And it is impressive, this, on the Super Nintendo. Why? Why am I not, like, firing out boosts? credits for seventh place okay I'm still top in the leaderboard Zosmar uh, boost to 10.1 BL Sustained power. It's a hundred and the. Can't even buy that. I've, I'm all spent up. I was expecting to rinse it. Jutka. Boy, he's so slow on the off. Okay, so my boosts, are, I have. So I wonder what the recharge is. So the boosts are the little green line, vertical lines next to the B, I think. It's kind of... Oh, yeah. Get on the road, get on the road, bro. place got my eye on that hundred thousand credits so the, yeah you see that's a boost so I wonder what the oh is the green thing like fueled yes I'm guessing it is because that's what top gear 2 had so the recharge is like fuel yeah okay okay repair but I still don't quite know where all the weapons are that it talked about Oof, oof. I also think Top Gear 2 uh, it just looked a little bit better I, I think I think this is decent this is a decent discovery but Top Gear 2 I would say is the better one but if you like racing games yeah I think you could do a lot worse than this on the Super Nintendo Yeah, you see some of the courses, it just looks a little bit like funky on the eyes and I don't remember it feeling that way when I was playing Top Gear 2. Ooh, momentary loss of concentration there. Final lap. Okay, I am absolutely rinsing my petrol. Gonna see how long. When I go over the fuel, I'm gonna try and go slower and see if that makes me get more fuel. Yeah. Yeah, it does. A bit of tactics there. A bit of tactics. I also think on easy, this is easier than Top Gear 2. Top Gear 2, I think I still did it on easy, but it was, uh, there was like squeaky bum time, sweaty palms time, you know, you, it, you weren't going to sort of completely run away with it like I have done this race. 
I also think the music was a little bit better. Secret bonus is D. Zero, 40,000 credits. Another 10 points. We're gonna take off. <clears throat> it's a shame that it's always the same. Zosmar, Turbis. I wonder if the big development in this game was that it had two player. Why are you not going? Maybe I'm doing something wrong with the launch from the beginning. I've got a feeling I'm going to need to be a bit more smarter with my fuel. Oh wow, we've got a Oh, was that was that some kind of uh pickup? Potentially, I have to go back for that in the next lap. 18th out of 20. I've got to floor it. <coughs> Run the risk of uh, of running out of petrol. But I need that first place. So let's go left. Yeah, remember left. Hopefully, I'll see the. Uh, yep, there it is. Plus four. Oh, okay, it's credits. Maybe the uh, weapons thing is like a multiplayer thing only, perhaps? A long lap, this. Eighth place. Come on, let's see if I can get catch him. Oh, how oh, lucky that was. mile an hour. Oof, and I've only just caught those guys. Got to get out of there. Yeah, that's very much an F zero thing. Sixth place. This is this is a harder race, for sure. Although I did scuff it at the beginning. <clears throat> I kind of gave them all a head start. Fifth position. credits. Is each one 4,000 credits? Because then I would have got quite a lot that time. That was perhaps not the smartest move, boosting over the recharge, but uh, fifth. Okay. I probably had one of the fastest laps then. 50,000 credits. Secret bonus C. Secret bonus D. Okay, I, I, I'm in top place still. Sarim. See what's the best engine I can buy. I've got 373,000. It's going to be that one, isn't it? Engine 3. 350 max revs. Quick and clean. That's what we like. Boost. 
boost. Alright, <clears throat> we'll give it one last go, one last race, see what this new engine's like. Oh, it's got some serious music, hasn't it? Okay, so that was a better launch. Oof. He says that, but I still got overtake overtaken. Here we are, this is a proper race now, isn't it? Eat my dirt. Straight to first, look at that, phenomenal work, phenomenal, this new engine. That's what's going to do me on this race, isn't it? My my engine is good, but it absolutely rinses the fuel. Look at that, that first lap, blimey. And I've already been... Where is... Here it is. Got to slow down for this. There we go. Got to be tactical with this one. Oof. Be a little bit smarter on the throttle, I think, as well. Instead of just flooring it. Because look, it's absolutely rinsing the fuel. See there again, I've I've sacrificed um, a lot. I've got a little bit of speed with this new engine, a little bit more speed, but in terms of fuel consumption, uh, that lap I thought I was pretty. I, I, I'd made an effort to be more efficient, but basically you've got to. I've got to get a full. It's a, each lap is a full tank. That's mad. Don't know how I missed that. My uh, car apparently has got phasing ability. You can phase in and out of reality <laughs> to avoid uh, bollards. Look, I'm. Oof. It is, it is an impressive engine for a racing game. I would say if I ha if I was going to rank them, Top Gear 2 at the top, then this, then Top Gear 1. Um, top Gear 2 actually being possibly the best racing game I've played on the Super Nintendo. Um, yeah, I, I, I thought about it. P possibly, I mean, it does something different to Mario Kart. It's... Mario Kart sort of more of a have a have a mess about kind of thing but it does have some it can be quite a serious racing game but then I think Top Gear 2 does it has like a few extra elements you know where you can upgrade your car and I think if it does have multiplayer 
and you really liked racing games on the Super Nintendo, I think you could do a lot, lot worse than having Top Gear 2. Um, yeah, right, so that's going to do it for this episode. That's Top Gear 3000. It's, I would put it as a decent discovery. Yeah, that'll do it for this episode. I'll see you guys next time.